Hey there guys, my name is and in this video I'm going to guide you on how we can use Zoho Social. Zoho Social is a good program that helps you manage your brand on social media. Now the first thing that we are going to do, I'm going to show you how we can easily create your account. If you already have your account created, just skip this step. Company name, Sanwi, email address, and password. Like this. And I agree, sign up for free. Now just wait until it loads. You just need to like set up for you. And then we will continue. And here we have it. So access the social. And here we go. So when you're going to enter Zoho Social, what core social media objective do you wish to accomplish using Zoho Social? Let's say every all free company size, zero to 10 employees I have, contact number, take me in. And now what you can do is to easily uh, set up your brand. So what you can do it's like connect Twitter account. And I'm going to add, I'm going to log in right here. So my recommendation is just easily log into all your social media accounts. And it's connecting right now. As you can see, awesome. You have created a brand Talman on social media. You can also uh, connect YouTube account. Google My Business, Instagram. I'm going to be only with Twitter right now, but you can connect whatever you want. Connect later. And now invite people to work on this brand. Here you can easily invite someone and you can attach a role to their email address as a brand admin user or limited publisher. Needs approval to publish content to social channels. And I'm going to skip it now, but here we can easily invite someone. And here we go. So first thing first, what I'm going to show you is a walkthrough. What you can actually expect from social as a home. So when you would enter home, you would see that you would got some analytics here, recent posts here. And then also the brand health as a followers, new followers, you would have Facebook here, Instagram, YouTube, and then on the right side, setting things up for you. Now, what you can do is next to home, you're going to see posts here. We are going to, I'm going to show you a published post, scheduled posts, everything. We will get to it. Then messages, messages. Uh, those are going to be from all social media accounts. You would have a Facebook here, YouTube, and you can easily communicate. So you don't have to connect to Twitter. You don't have to connect to Facebook. You can actually like use it only social Zoho, then monitoring mentions, connections, collaborate, report, and we will get to it and lead forums. So this is the walkthrough what you can get on the top, right? You can simply uh, see your account here and you can also access settings. And when you're going to enter settings here, you would see like social channels here that you can connect. So let's say I'm going to connect also LinkedIn profile. And I'm going to sign in. Allow. Sign in. And okay, so. Add. 
and voila so right now we have the linkedin and we have also twitter account now let me show you what you can do also in settings and then we'll go how we can create posts and everything so this is my brand members publishing roles and permissions you can create a new role here and you can invite people etc so let's go first thing first on posts here you would be seeing publish posts uh, for linkedin what you are publishing for twitter scheduled posts approvals so let's say uh, you have employee and they would like send something for approval you would find it right here unpublished posts drafts and calendar now when i'm going to click on a new post on the top right i can both schedule a lot of posts or just click new post here let's say i have linkedin profile when you're going to click on it you're going to disable it so you have option to choose mm, let's say just twitter or everything else reminder content is a king so i can just easily write here so hey there i hope you are having great day we have 10 percent off all products today and as you can see look at this uh you always gonna see the number which is decreasing it's how many letters can you write like the more i'm going to write the number is decreasing so this is how you post it then on the bottom you would see you can attach multiple photos or for a video and let's say i can use a cloud picker i can design it on canva i can use media library or desktop so let's say i'm going to post a really good quote here let me show you attach and this is an attach so na nature does not hurry yet everything is accomplished so you see right here the preview then you can also add location you can also enable location tagging on twitter and you can add location on facebook etc so i hope you're getting ready we have 10 percent of all products today and then we have a quote nature does not hurry yet everything is accomplished you can add a direct message link to your tweet so again this is something that you will have possibly on facebook too that you can receive direct messages for this you can add emoji see pretty simply and let's say that we can also do the alt text and let's say this is for twitter wow to save so with alt text you can add emojis you can add direct message links to your tweet and locations and now we can publish it now or you can schedule it for a specific date so let's say i'm going to schedule it for 20 of friday or we are going to publish this now but we're going to create a different one for scheduling so you're going to see how it actually works time zone what time you can also repeat the post so let's say what you can do is to repeat it every two weeks you can also add it to query query contents for unique time slots to white overlaps so let's say that you would have like multiple things scheduled out and you would add just to query then smart queue slot publish content at times when your audience is most likely to engage and this like is going to mm, use it for the best times that it should publish it will publish so i'm going to publish it now i will just delete this and we're going to look how it looks like you can also come here and click preview the photo you can also save the draft here or just click post now okay and let me go to twitter look at this i hope you have a great day nature does not hurry yet everything is accomplished see 
So this is how we can do it. And uh, this is how it works. Now, when I come to post, I see that we're going to see the post content here. And published by my email. So let's say that we are going to uh, create scheduled posts. New post, same thing. And I'm going to add a photo. Of my shaman back here. Attach. Okay, wait a second, you need to resize it, so I'm going to choose a different one. Baby Yoda. Okay. And as I mentioned, under publish now, we're going to see the schedule for a specific date. And let's say I'm going to schedule it for Friday, AM, and schedule. And when I would come here to the scheduled post, we can see clearly our post here. Now, when you would like switch between Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn, you would see all the possible segments, all the possible social media accounts that you can upload it to, right? And you can post it now, or I can also edit it. I can free dots and simply delete it. So this is how the posts work. And this is how we can work with posts. The next thing are messages. So I can simply click here messages. And here, let's say I'm going to chat with someone. I wrote to some game. Hi hey there, when this game comes out. I know it's today, but at what time, please? And if someone is going to write you on our Twitter, you would find your own conversation here. You can keep the conversation going. You're going to see the personal information right here. It's email, phone, mobile. Interactions and recent tweets. So you'll find it straight away here. And if you're going to have connect with Facebook, you would find a Facebook account also here. And this is how the messages work. If you're going to have any questions, guys, regards of what I was talking about right now with the posts, with the messages, ask down below in comments. I'm really happy to help you. Next to the messages, we're going to have monitor. And monitor are mentions. You would find who talked to you about, about your company, about your brand on Facebook. And this is how we do it, right? You would see mentions here. And this is how monitors work. And the next thing are connections. So when I'm going to click here on connections, you would find the recently engaged posts, most engaged, all connections that you have. Twitter following. With your followers. So you see that I follow Toby Lutke, which is the CEO, James Clear. He's amazing. Amused Chim. That's a really interesting account. And then Twitter followers. You would find this also for Facebook and for LinkedIn page that you would have connected. Now these are the connections. Then you're gonna see also collaborations. Here you can see discussions, bring your team member to invite them here. And then you would like talk with others in Zoho Social talking about stuff like, like what's cooking and hey guys, share. So this is how we do it. And this is how we collaborate with others. You can see discussions, drafts, approvals, posts, scheduled posts, even you can schedule posts for here, messages, connections and reports. So the last two things that I'm going to share with you are reports. 
here in reports you would find all the analytics you can create for twitter reports you had facebook reports here you can create custom reports even and what do you want to have that audience summary tweets engagement summary follow growth you can connect everything you want the more medias that you're going to have the more connections you're able to do so this is pretty much how zoho social works and this is how we can work with reports it's completely up to you what you want to actually see so it's difficult for me to share that oh my god you need to have this you need to have that next to the reports you would find also lead forms and lead forms are good for linkedin and facebook And you need to like set up the LinkedIn ads here, but this is the same stuff, right? Let's say you're going to be on reports in reports. I can see that I have LinkedIn in messages, right? So this is pretty much it guys, how we do it. Then next to the new post, you would find bulk schedule. And then you have like multiple posts in one go that you can do. But you need to set this up. So if you can have any questions. So let's say I'm going to Baby Yoda. Or you need to like CSV file. You can schedule multiple posts here. So if you can have any questions, guys, ask me down in comments. This was a Zoho Social tutorial, Zoho Social Beginner's Guide, how to use Zoho Social, Zoho Social uh, for Beginners, Zoho Social 2022, Zoho Social Guide, Zoho Social Tutorial. You know how it goes, you know how it is. So thank you very much, guys, for watching. And have a great day and goodbye. See ya.